differential equation the first step is to separate the variables so we make everything with y on one side everything with x on the other side by multiplying or dividing so here we um, multiply both sides by dx over y because you can cancel out cancel out on the left we have only 1 over y dy on the right we have x over 1 plus x squared dx now we separate the variables i mean after separating the variables we integrate both sides to integrate 1 over y we can just use this formula and we get ln y simple without the modulus and to integrate the right hand side well first of all we cannot use these formulas because you see we have no x in the numerator in this formula so we cannot use this so we can use this we have to use this instead so if you want to use this formula in the mf19 we have to make sure that the numerator is the derivative of the denominator because this is f prime this is f so we have to make sure that what we have here is the derivative of this guy we can do that by adjusting or modifying a little we have to make it 2 but we're gonna change the question if we do this so we also divide by 2 so now since the numerator is the derivative of the denominator we can use this formula what we get is ln the denominator so ln 1 plus x squared so um, don't forget the constant of integration this is called the general solution of the differential equation now to find the particular solution we plug in y equals 2 x equals 0 we replace the y and the x we can find the value of c so um, if you use your calculator this is actually 0 after we find the c this is called the particular solution now of the differential equation now we express y in terms of x simplified expression so we have to make it y equals something we can start by moving this um, one half inside the uh, logarithm it becomes the power like this and to the power of one half means square root and then we can combine the ln addition becomes multiplication so two times square root of and last step we um, do e to the power of to cancel out the ln and we have y equals 2 root 1 plus x squared for the final answer all right see you again